I had a little trouble with, with some of the lines at the buffets. I, I, I don't do well in any kind of a line. I, I think I'm a pretty nice person, but you put me in a line, something happens to me. I lose my cherub-like demeanor, I really do. I want to know what's going on up there. I want to know why it's so slow. What, it's, so I'm, I'm in this long buffet line, and there are these older ladies in front of me, and it's an elaborate buffet. It has ice sculptures, and it has watermelons that are carved into sharks, and little cantaloupe baskets, and they're browsing. Oh, look at that over there. Oh, it's a, it's a cantaloupe basket. And I just, I, I'm trying to maintain, but in my head I'm going, get out of line. And they're taking pictures with their camera phones, their cell phones, and they don't know how to use them. So they're, they're going, get out of line, get out. <laughs> they're taking pictures of a watermelon shark. Why? Are you gonna pull this out at a later date? What? Are, how sad is your life if you have to stop and go, I want you to see this watermelon shark I saw. I ate the watermelon shark to prevent future browsing. behind you, have a little courtesy. I get browsers. At McDonald's, people stare at the menu. I had one guy in front of me was like, well, what do they have? <laughs> it's McDonald's. Pass me anything, left to right, right to left. What do you want to know? of the food, point, ah, down the line. I went to KFC, which is tasty, but it's a nutritional equivalent to smoking crack. And, but people at KFC, they stare. They have chicken. You know what else they have? Chicken. Would you like chicken or chicken? I don't mess with people behind the counter. I think working in, 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 uh, in the service industry is very difficult, and I don't like being rude or inconsiderate. I, I always feel bad when I'm rude and inconsiderate, but at Starbucks, eh, they're really slow. I have to have coffee in the morning or I can't function. My first cup could not be Starbucks. I'd be dead by the time I got to the front of that line. I just... They talk about making coffee. I'm doing espressos, who's doing lattes? Santos is doing lattes. I'm not doing lattes, I've been back getting the scones. You got coffee up there? Go we'll drink some of that shit, let's move it. I got a headache. I have to stop and get coffee to stand in line for their coffee. You know what holds up lines nowadays? Every place you have to have a card. At grocery stores, at pharmacies, you buy a book, you buy vitamins, you buy shower gel, you buy underwear. They go, you got your card? Do you don't have our card? Do you have our club card? Do you have our card? No! I have money. I'll give you money and you give me my stuff. Some clerks at night still swipe their card. Here, I swipe my card for you. Other ones, they insist, I'm gonna put an application in for your card. No! I want that card! Every place you gotta have a card. Remember when stuff was on sale or not on sale? Now we gotta have this card. I hate it. <laughs> I travel too many places to have cards for everywhere. One lady last week asked me for my zip code. Why? I was flipped. I said, I don't have a zip code. Well, her head almost exploded. Everybody has a zip code. She been in register three, he doesn't have a zip code. People in line are talking about me. No zip code, no zip code, no zip code. I go to this one place to eat with my family and they get, it's the line so long they give you a beeper. What does that mean? A beeper. Go home, get something to eat. We'll write your letter, tell you how good the food was. 
at Christmas time, oh, well, first of all, every store at Christmas time, the grocery stores, and I always get these ladies in front of me that are the coupon ladies, and they haven't decided which coup yeah, you coupons, you bitch. <laughs> now write a check for seven dollars. Oh, you left your card in the car? God, God! Every line at Christmas time is horrible. And I go to this mall in the food court, there's no line. There's just a sea of lines that lead to nowhere. Like, you'll get in one line for Chinese food, you'll get to the front, and it's a subway. You know, ah! <laughs> now, I like subway, but I get browsy people in front of me. They can't decide. They can't decide. People can't decide at Subway. That makes me sad. You ask them what bread they want. They don't know. They got to think about it. You ask them what they want in their sandwich, and they don't know. You don't know what you want in your sandwich? I know what I wanted on my sandwich since I was like one. <laughs> Lettuce, tomato, mayonnaise, extra pickle. When I was 13, I added green pepper. That's it. <laughs> How do you live? You don't know what you want in your sandwich. <laughs> How do you get married, have kids, buy a house, if you don't know what you want in your sandwich? Get out of line! Watch me! Watch me! There's this ice cream place that I go to in Vegas called Cold Stone Creamery. And it's good. Do they have it here? Ha uh ha -huh ha. -huh. <laughs> it's really tasty, but it's the ice cream, and then they mix the toppings in. Very browsy. And I was back off the road. I was driving to my house in Vegas, and I saw the Cold Stone Creamery. And I told the driver, pull over, I'm getting an ice cream. It was like a million degrees. And he said, not now, because I have another pickup. So he wipes the blood from his head. <laughs> and he says, I could use an ice cream, too. <laughs> Besides, I'm a little dizzy. I really shouldn't be driving right now. So I go into this line at Cold Stone Creamery, and it's out the door. And I'm trying to be nice, but people are browsing up there. The little man in my head is now going, get out of line, get out of line, get out of line, get out of line. Get out of line, get out of line. Every stupid question people ask, this, I, I have like an Ewok-like growl for every stupid question. This coupon is expired. Can I still use it? <laughs> I'm lactose intolerant. <laughs> Are toppings extra? I didn't think toppings were extra. <laughs> How big is your small? Can I see it? It's small! The smalls are small. It's $2. Here's 20. Buy 11 of them. Get out of line! It's 120 degrees and you ask, how big is the small? Is it big? And that's when I killed them, Your Honor. <laughs> People were browsing so much, I got up there. My turn to browse. What would you like in your ice cream? Ham. <laughs> you don't got any ham? I'll wait. There's a supermarket across the street. You got your car? 